Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Theodora and in today's video, I'm going to be doing the 10 art styles challenge. It was an idea that one of you guys actually suggested in one of my community posts in which I asked you to give me some more challenge ideas. By the way, thank you so much for all those suggestions. They were all amazing. Also, if you don't know what the 10 art style challenge is, it's basically an art challenge where you draw one of your own original characters, not only in your art style, but also in nine other art styles. So yeah, it's a pretty big art challenge since you literally draw the same OC over and over again. And the character I chose for this challenge is my OC Maya, who I actually created last year using watercolors. Anyways, one thing I haven't done in a long time is post a video that is not short. Literally, my last longer video was posted in December and it was also an entry for a Christmas themed contest. But to be honest, I didn't have the time to film then. I was pretty busy with schoolwork. Um, now that it's summer, I've got the time. So I'm going to try to film more and post longer videos because spoiler alert, I also have some ideas in mind for future videos. Something else I haven't done in quite some time is a video with a voiceover. Anyway, now I'm drawing Maya in the old Disney art style. And by old Disney art style, I mean the art style that's mainly used in movies such as Cinderella or Beauty and the Beast. I decided to go for the old and vintage version of Disney's art style just because I'm still a beginner and I just don't have much experience in lighting and shadows, so I wanted to go for something that's just a little bit more simple. Something that I really wanted to mention earlier but I didn't uh, is thank you so much for 500 subscribers. I know I've said this so many times but it really is a big milestone and I just wanted to say a huge thank you for all your support and everything really. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Don't worry, we're close to the end. There are only two art styles left and both of them are actually anime. I just finished the Pokemon art style and I'm moving on to the very last one, which is Sailor Moon art style. I actually really love the way this one turned out and it's definitely one of my favorites. I love the way the eyes are so cute and just anime is just so cute. The art style is always just the cutest. Anyway, what's left to do is put them all together. And there you have it, the 10 art style challenge is complete. Please let me know in the comments down below what you think and which one is your favorite. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Have a great day, bye!